Hey guys, it's been a while since I filmed a video. Um, I'm still in the same setup. This is why I don't like filming videos because I don't really like my setup right now. Um, so, excuse the light. My light is coming from over there, the window, the natural light. Um, so, you're going to see double chin and all that mess. Um, also, I live on a really busy street, so you're going to hear cars. You're going to hear people. I apologize for that, but... I really wanted to come on here and do this video because I've been seeing a lot of videos going around on people getting like good stuff from Marshalls and I personally have become addicted to Marshalls. I work right next door to Marshalls so I go in there every day um, but people they usually do the videos where they're like in Marshalls it's like the live video they're filming while they're in there but me personally I can't do that because when I'm in there, I have to concentrate. Like, I have to dig through stuff and look through stuff and whatever. So, I maybe I will in the future, but as of right now, I'm not doing that live kind of video. So, I'm just going to show you collectively everything that I got from Marshalls. Um, all of this was not in one trip. This was in, like, several trips. I go in there every day because they get new things, like, every day. So, um, they have, like, a lot of high-end brands in there for really cheap. Now, what I've heard, or what people are saying, like, on YouTube is that, um, when, like, Sephora or something, like, orders too much stuff, that they sell the leftovers to Marshalls, or that if it's, like, a discontinued package or something like that, they sell it to Marshalls, and that's why they're able to sell it for so cheap. So, I'm just going to collectively show you everything that I got. Um, so yeah, speaking of like the repackaged things, this is what I'm going to show you first. This is the, the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. Um, she came out with like a new packaging, like the refillable package or whatever. Ooh, I'm sorry, it's really dirty, but I love it. And yeah, at mostly everything in here I've already opened and used already. So I'm going to try to remember the price and tell you guys the price. Um, I think this was $24.99. It's usually like $40, I think. I'm not sure, but you can go into your local Marshalls. And I have a few things from TJ Maxx, too, I'm going to throw in there. Um, but yeah, I think this was $24.99. This is the Shade and Light Contour Palette. Um, the next thing I got was a shitload of Anastasia. Beverly Hills Liquid Lipsticks. I'm pretty sure everybody knows this already. Um, but you can get them for $6.99 at Marshalls. So, I gotten all of these. You're not going to really be able to see them. But I, these are two lip, gloss, lip glosses. The one with the black packaging. Um, I still have one in the package that I didn't open yet. And I also have this little trio that they had. This came out, I think, like this came out recently, so I was really excited when I saw this. But this is a trio with Dazed, um, what is it? Dazed, Bittersweet, and Hudson. Hudson is my favorite. This is like a really pretty, like the perfect nude. Um, but I got all of these. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight liquid lipsticks. Um, at six ninety nine a piece, and that really built up my lipstick collection so I'm happy about those and the next thing I got still with Anastasia Beverly Hills is the lip palette um I don't remember how much this cost because I take everything out of the box as soon as I get home because I'm so excited about it but I think this was $24.99 I think but it's just a lip palette um, you can mix colors and everything like that with it. It comes with a little spatula and a lip brush. So, yeah. They have a lot of, like, most, the most thing they have is Anastasia Beverly Hills. So, I got a lot of that stuff. So, sticking with that brand, I also got the blush kit and Radiant. I got the other one, too, the deeper one, but I gave it away because it was too deep on my skin tone. So, I gave it to my sister-in-law. She's like a deeper skin tone, so yeah, this is really nice. I like this Anastasia blush kit. This was, 
I think $20, nineteen ninety nine. Um, The next thing I got, I was so excited. I like stalked my Marshalls for days. Because what I do is I watch videos of what other people got. And then I, I go to look to see if my Marshalls had it. So I was excited when I saw this. The Anastasia Aurora Glow Kit. Um, this is so pretty. I haven't really used it yet. I swatched it. But I haven't used it yet. And this was, I think, twenty four ninety nine as well. Um, I have all my stuff in front of me. The next thing that I got, I was also really happy to see this was the NARS Laguna Tier Bronzer. I've heard of the Laguna Bronzer, but I never heard of the Laguna Tier Bronzer. I think it's limited edition. But I was so excited when I saw this in Marshalls. And I don't remember the price because I took it out of the packaging. And this was a while ago that I got it. So yeah, this is really nice. I used it. It has like a kind of a, a, a shimmer to it. Which I don't really like for bronzers. But I still love it because it's NARS. And it's limited edition packaging and everything like that. So yeah. Um... The next thing I got were some Too Faced items. I was so shocked to see them in Marshalls. Um, I'm missing a liquid lipstick. I don't know why I did. But whatever. It's Oh, no. This is it. I'm missing a lip gloss that it came with. It came in like a pack with two liquid lipsticks and two melted. They're not liquid lipsticks. Two melted lipsticks. You know the melted but I gave the melted ones away because I don't really like those. And then I also had a melted latex, but I can't find it right now. But it was just a nude nude color. And then this liquid lipstick. I just wanted to try out the formula because I had never tried these before. And I don't remember how much they were because this was a while ago. So yeah. And then also I found this Too Faced Lip Insurance Glossy. I don't know. I was really confused how this works. Like I put it on my lips and it got really sticky. So I'm guessing it's like a primer for a lip gloss. So it gets sticky so you so the lip gloss will stick better to your mouth. I don't know. But I just saw that it was Too Faced that I needed it so I got it. I don't remember how much it was. Um, the next thing Too Faced I got was this Royal Oil. It's like a body bronzer. It's a liquid bronzer. You put it like on your body. It's coconut oil. It smells really good. But I figured for the summertime, like, why not? I'll give it a try. I don't remember how much this was either. Um, next Too Faced thing I got was the Too Faced Cat Eyes Palette. And it looks like this. And it's really pretty. It's like a nice neutral palette. It has, like, mostly shimmers in it. And it has some mattes. But, yeah, it is really pretty Too Faced. I don't remember how much this was either. I think it was... $14.99, I think. Um, so yeah, that's all the Too Faced stuff that I got. Um, the next thing I got was a highlighting palette. I was souped to see this too. When I went in there, I saw this other girl. She had it in her hand. And I'm like, oh no, maybe she got the last one because I didn't see it. But then I looked underneath like in a little corner and I found it. And it's the Smash... Is it, oh, it's right now. Okay. <clears throat> it's the Smashbox highlighting palette. Um, everybody's saying that, <clears throat> excuse me, it's the collab with Casey Holmes. I don't know who Casey Holmes is, but I know I heard about it and I saw it on Instagram. But it doesn't have her name on here, like the Smashbox X Casey Holmes or whatever. And this is still in the packaging because I didn't, um, I didn't, um, take it out of the packaging. But I'm going to take it out now to show you. It's really pretty. Like, I swatched it and everything like that. It's really pretty. And it's just like gold highlighters. Like this one is more like a champ like, like a white champagne gold. This one is like a true champagne gold. And then this one is really glittery. They say to use this as like a blush topper or whatever. Or you can use it as a highlight if you're into glittery highlights. But yeah, it's really pretty. And I don't remember how this how much this one was either. I'm sorry, but you can just go to your Marshall. Like I'm pretty sure everybody has a Marshalls near them. Um, but yeah, 
and also I forgot the I should have mentioned this at the beginning of the video but I'm doing a giveaway with a lot of this stuff that I got here I will show you know what let me actually show you everything I'm giving away so I'm giving away one of these I'm giving away the Aurora um, glow kit and the blush kit because I got doubles of all these so I can do a giveaway I'm giving away an Anastasia lip palette I'm giving away a Anastasia the trio I'm also giving away like a couple single liquid lipsticks and lip glosses um, what else am I giving away um, this next item I found a Burberry I was so sweet when I saw this a Burberry mascara it's so pretty the packaging is Burberry and everything like that so I'm giving away one of these um, what else am I giving away I can't remember but I'm gonna do a separate video on the giveaway so look out for that um, okay so moving on also these Anastasia another Anastasia product that I forgot to mention along with the Anastasia thing they have um, single eyeshadows for $3.99 and I picked up four of them so the top row is not Anastasia these four are Anastasia single shadows this is in the shade fawn this is like a nice really a really nice transition color like a soft brown from Mac kind of vibe um, this is rich brown this is like a really dark deep like ashy brown this is Topaz. This is a a really pretty um like shimmery brown bronzy color. And then this is 10K. This is just like a nice gold, like light gold color. So yeah, I got those and I put in my little Z palette. Um next I got some makeup forever things. Now I I've been seeing people finding the Pro Bronze Fusion palettes from Makeup Forever that has the bronzer and the highlight in it. I've been on the lookout, but I haven't found it yet. But I just got the Makeup Forever HD setting powder. It looks like this. And I also got the pressed version. It came like in a little set. And I don't remember how much these were. I'm sorry, but I don't remember. Um, this is just a little pressed version. So I was excited about Makeup Forever. Um, what's next? What's next? I just got this little like um, sheet mask. They have a whole section with sheet mask in there. So this is from Patchology, and this is it's called Flash Mask Five Minute Facial Sheet Illuminate. So it's like a, an illuminating face mask. I love. I'm into skincare lately, so yeah. I don't remember how much this was either, but it was cheap, probably like three or four dollars, if that. So I got that, and then. OMG. The last thing that I got. Well, no, let me show this one first before I show these. I just got the old Hendrickson Truth Truth Facial Water. Um, it says energy energize and hydrate with mandarin, white tea, and pomegranate. It's just like a face spray, like to refresh your makeup. You can use it before makeup. You can set your I don't know if you can set your makeup with it, but whatever. I use it, it's not that great, but whatever. I saw a lot of people, and I hear about this brand at Sephora all the time, so. And I don't remember how much this was, sorry about that. And some really exciting stuff that I got from Marshalls. I found Glam Glow at Marshalls. So I got this Glam Glow Thirsty Cleanse Daily Hydrating Cleanser. This was $16.99, I remember this, how much this was. Um... It's just like a it's a mud to foam. So you when you pump it out on your hand it's mud and then when you like go put it on your face it turns into a foam. I used it, it's it's okay. I mean it did make my face really, 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 really soft. But I don't know how good it did at cleansing. But I'm gonna have to keep trying this. But it's really pretty. And sixteen ninety nine. I went on Sephora's website and this retails for thirty dollars in Sephora. So that was exciting and I also got a glam glow mask I see other people they have like the good ones like the thirsty bud or whatever like the black one the black and silver one I haven't found that one but I found this one and it's the brightening treatment and it smells really good I used it once they say you're supposed to use it three days in a row to like 
to start off with and then two to three times a week. But I only use it once because I don't really have time for all that. But yeah, this retails for like $69 in Sephora and I got it at Marshalls for $40, which is really good. Okay. And also another thing that I wanted to throw in here, I got these um, Shea Moisture Baby Wipes. These are really good for taking off my makeup. Like, I've been using it. I use it in the morning to even, like, wipe my face first before I wash it, like, to get all the little stuff out of your eyes or whatever. But it's with raw Shea, Mo um, Shea Moisture. Shea Butter, Chamomile, and Arrogant Oil. This one I got first, and then this is my backup. But I use it to take off my makeup because it works really good. Um... And then, this is the most recent thing I got for Marshalls, and I'm really excited about it, is the Impressions Vanity. Okay, this is my setup. Let me show you how ghetto my setup is. I'm using my phone, propped up on some stuff. So yeah, don't mind that. But this is the Impressions Vanity Light Up Mirror, and this was $16.99. They do have the newer version, where you can use, like, Bluetooth and all that crap on it for a hundred dollars at Marshall's when it retails for like a hundred and something on their website or whatever I think um, but yeah I got this for $16.99 and when I first put the batteries in it I was using this back here this little clicker thing and it wasn't working so I was mad I'm like oh and it was just like this on the table there was no box no nothing so I'm like maybe it's broken like you know but then later on I was scrolling through Instagram because I follow impressions vanity on Instagram and I saw the same mirror and it says the touch 2.0 so then it registered in my head I'm like touch oh my god so all you have to do is touch down here and it turns on this is so pretty I needed a mirror to do my makeup in, and now I found it, so $16.99 at Marshalls. I wanted the pink one, like the rose gold pink one, but I only saw the black one, so I got it. Like, I'm not that picky. So, yeah, that's everything I got at Marshalls, and then I ran over to TJ Maxx, which is like across the way, and I got a couple of stuff. I usually don't like going to TJ Maxx because they never have anything there like nothing i've went there at least three to four times and they never had not one single thing so i was excited this time i'm gonna start off with the less boring stuff but i got these creme the creme shop mask face mask it's the unicorn ones these are so cute and it has like the hollow packaging that's so cute but these are the it says clear up skin animated unicorn face mask infused with clarifying strawberry milk so I got two packs of these. I think they were $4.99 each. So I got these. Um, the next thing I got was a Kat Von D concealer. This is like the old concealer in the old packaging. That's why it was there. I think this was, I don't remember. I want to say like $6.99, I think. And then next thing I got was a Stila foundation. The Stila Aqua Glow Serum Foundation. And this is so cute, the way the packaging is set up. It looks like this. And then when you unscrew it, let me see if you can see it. This little thing pops up. And then it's a dropper. And you press this thing at the top, and it drops. It's so nice. It's really lightweight. I tried a little bit on my face like this. Um, it's in the color light. It's not the perfect match for me. It is a little light for me, but... I'm going to try to make it work. I don't remember how much this was, though. I'm sorry about that. And then I got uh, Anastasia. Sorry. <sighs> My legs are falling asleep. Okay. So the last thing I got was... Um, not the last thing. Second to last thing was the Anastasia Waterproof Cream Color. And the color Sable. I figured I'd get it to try to do my eyebrows with, but... It was a little dark and not the right color. Maybe when I dye my hair again. Um, but yeah, if not, I can use it for eyeliner. Like sometimes if you don't want a black eyeliner, you can use this. It's like a really dark brown. But yeah, I got that. And I don't remember how much this was. I'm sorry. I have a thing where I take all the price tags off everything because I don't like the way it looks in the packaging. I'm weird like that. But yeah. 
I don't remember how much this was. I want to say like $6.99. Like it's, the Anastasia stuff is usually not that expensive, but yeah. And then the last little thing I got was this Clinique Acne Solutions Clearing Gel. It's just a little mini size. I don't remember how much this was either. So yeah, I'm sorry about that. But that was at TJ Maxx. My TJ Maxx sucks. Like I see other girls get really good stuff at TJ Maxx, but I mine isn't really that good and I'm never really that lucky. But yeah, oh, and I forgot, I got this little um, study kiss lipstick from Kat Von D in the shade Lolita. I always wanted to try the liquid lipstick, but I never got to try it. But yeah, that's basically everything I got from Marshalls. Um, yeah, so check out your local Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Some girls even, I'm not driving right now, so I don't have this privilege, but go to check out different TJ Maxx's in your area because different locations have different things and they get new stuff in every day so I, I'm addicted like I'm addicted I have to go every day I work right next door to my Marshalls so and my Marshalls is pretty good but my TJ Maxx just sucks but yeah um like I said I'm doing a giveaway I got a bunch of the same stuff that I got not everything, but mostly everything of the same things. And I'm going to do a giveaway for my Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, it's rebel underscore makeup. And subscribe to me here on YouTube so you don't miss the video when I post of everything that I'm giving away. Um, like I said, excuse all the noise in this, in this video, like people talking, coughing in the background. I just wanted to get this up because I was so excited and I've been like hoarding this stuff for weeks. So, yeah. Like I said, stay tuned for my giveaway. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe to me here. And thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you like these kind of videos. I'll do more, like all the stuff that I get from Marshalls every week or every day or whatever. Um, I got some other stuff too, but I didn't think it was that interesting, like some hair care stuff and like little, like little things, like stuff that I like, you know, to have. Um, but yeah, thank you so much. Give this video a thumbs up. Um, and I'll see you next time. Hopefully next time it will be a makeup tutorial. Like I said, my setting, my setup is not the best right now, so yeah, bear with me. But thank you so much for watching. See you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.